everyone, welcome to my channel. So today I am going to be unboxing the Good Vibe Scribe box for December 2020. If you're unfamiliar with the Good Vibe Scribe subscription, it is a monthly, I would call it a lifestyle subscription because you get tons of different products inside that send you good vibes each month and helps support small businesses. So I'll talk a little bit about the businesses featured in this box as we go through it. Now this box is $45 a month. Um, they do have a premium version which is $50 um, where you actually get to make some selections inside of the box. If you're a 6 or 12 month subscriber you do also get to make those selections as well. Now, this month it's a little bit different. They're doing two different theme boxes because they couldn't decide on one. So there is the buffalo plaid box and then also the Grinch box. Um, so I don't know which one I have quite yet. Now if you are one of the premium subscribers or the 6 or 12 month subscribers you do get to pick which one you want and you can purchase both if you really want both um, but just that you know there are a limited amount of boxes to be able to do that. I do have a code down below and if you sign up using my code you do get a free gift with your first box. Now they did send this to me free for review so I did not pay for the box. They also let me know that they have um, a promotion going on until December 20th where you can build your own box with products from their vibe shop. You can get five items for $25 with free shipping. The promo code is BYOB in all caps. Um, and you can get more information on their social media pages. Now to get the December box, you do have to sign up by December 5th. So there's a couple days for you when I'm uploading this um, to be able to get the December box. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I do lots of different subscription box unboxing videos here. So if you're a sub box lover like me, or you just want to get to learn more about subscription boxes, go ahead and subscribe. And let's finally get into this box. So this month it came in a white box with this like kind of like holiday kind of design, which I really love. Their traditional box is like teal and very summery. So I like that they kind of um, switched it up for the winter months. And when you open it up, that is what it looks like. I don't think I said this, but this, this box does come with five full size products. Okay, I think that I got the Grinch box. So I'm really excited about that. I think that's the one that I would want unless because they sent this to me for review, this is a mix of both, but it does have green um, like little squigglies inside. So I think I got the Grinch box, which is super fun. I love the Grinch movies. Oh. Oh my gosh, the first item is amazing. It's a Christmas tree ornament, and this is what it says. It says, 2020 stink, stank, stunk. Oh my gosh, and it has the Grinch hand holding a mask. So this is by Driftless Studios Christmas. So they had the stink, stank, stunk mask ornament and a, oh, there's something else. Wait a second, it's not just this. And a Merry Grinchmas box sign. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Oh, I love it. This ornament is awesome. Um, so I'll read a little bit about the company. So the home decor business is rife with importers and large companies using cheap materials and lazy designs. At Driftless Studios, we do things differently. We design everything in-house and source quality materials, build it by hand, and product test everything we sell. Um, this year came with a lot of unexpected life changes and we could all use some extra laughs. Enjoy this lighthearted graphic ornament to commemorate and embrace the craziness that 2020 brought us. And then, um, yeah, the, this as well. Now I will say my mom specifically was like, we need to get ornaments that like just commemorate this year, just like as a memory. And so she bought myself and my sister and herself a little, um, snowman ornament, a metal one that had like a mask on just to remember this year. But honestly, this one, I have to show this to her. This one is, is insane. Um, I just love the stink, stink, stunk. I just think it's so cute. Oh, the smell of like the burnt wood. I love that. I, um, did woodworking in middle school and made like a kitchen island and all this stuff. But one of the assignments was to like, to burn like the wood and etch the wood. And I just love the smell. I loved doing it. Um, but that is so cute. I'm so excited. I'm definitely putting that on my tree. I need to figure out where I put the hooks. Okay, good. I, for a second, I thought I might have already put the box back up, but I don't think that I will have to go through all that work. And then this is super cute too. I, it, it is definitely like chunky, hefty wood, which I super appreciate. It does feel like really, really good quality. You could probably hang this up or just like stick it out. And I'm definitely going to stick it out because I think that it's really cute. And if you look down at the ornament, it has the little Grinch smile in it. So that's super fun. I love that. The next thing that I'm pulling out is from the Purple Chickadee, and this is a pair of earrings. They are upside down um, on the thing, so just imagine them the other way around. This is the Glitter Christmas Tree Acrylic Earrings. 
Um, so the Purple Chickadee started as a small-scale hobby in 2015. As the years have passed, they have grown to much larger than they ever imagined. Their products are made in-house by herself, Danielle, and she strives to make the best material so she can offer quality, lasting jewelry pieces. Um, which is awesome. So I think these are really, really cute. I don't think I own a pair of Christmas earrings. So this is nice. I own a piece of Halloween earrings now. I have pumpkin earrings, but I don't think I have little tree ones. And these are really cute. I think I got them to kind of stay up now, but they're really, really cute little studs that you could pair. You could pair them alongside other earrings or just wear them as is. So those are really, really cute. I love that. I don't really have any like Christmas specific jewelry. So it's nice to get that um, in a box. I don't really know if the world will see these this year, but I can wear them at home and be festive at home on my own. So as a side note, I'm just looking through the pamphlet. So it looks like you, this month, the selection was which box you wanted. A lot of times you may have like different colors or assortments of a product. So there might've been like two ornaments to pick from or something um, for different categories. But for this month, you just picked, do you want the Grinch box or do you want the Buffalo? plaid box. The next thing out is from Candied Nails and this is their real nail polish strips in holiday fun and Christmas. I think you just get one or the other because I'm only seeing one here. So it says Suni Costello, the founder and creator of Candied Nails, saw a gap in the nail salon market and set out to fill it. Um, with more than 100 choices, Candy Nails uses real nail polish strips that easily apply to nails and since the unique and fun designs are created with real nail polish, um, not, nails not only feel pretty but remain healthy and undamaged. Interesting. I tend to leave my nails blank because these things scare me. Not like they're probably really easy to use, but I just get nervous to do it on my own. I need like my sister to be here with me when I do it so that if I'm just completely failing, somebody can step in because I'm not good at nails at all. Like when I paint my nails, the nail polish is like all the way up and down my hands. It's not a cute look, but these do look really cute and easy. So I'm, I might have to try these out. I wonder, it says how many, how much, how much is in here? 16 strips and that fit all nails. Oh, so there's multiple. So I could, my sister and I could have matching nails and my mom. That might be fun. The next thing out is a food item and I will never complain about food. This is from Homemade Toffee Co. This is their candy cane organ hazelnut toffee. Whoa, that sounds amazing. Um, it says we put a little bit of happiness into every box of homemade toffee. That's our promise. We've been crafting artisan toffee for over 30 years and we plan to do so for generations to come. Each batch is handmade utilizing Oregon grown hazelnuts and ingredients sourced from around the Pacific Northwest. Um, so it says tis the season crushed candy cane adorns the top of this delicious and beautiful toffee treat adding a festive crunch. Um, we have sourced candy canes made with non-corn syrup or red dye 40. This recipe uses pure cane sugar and is colored using red cabbage and purple carrots. I see I see more nuts than I do candy cane on here. The one in the picture looks like it has more, but I'm totally fine with it that way. And I do love that they did it that way. So there, it contains no gluten, no soy, no corn syrup, and no preservatives. I This might be eaten tonight. This looks really, really good. I love Christmassy desserts. And last but not least is from Wabi Whiffs. And this is their Christmas toilet sprinkle shake, sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle shaker. Toilet sprinkle shaker. Okay, what does this do? Because I was like, oh, bath salt. <laughs> Not sure about that. So it says, we all poo, some more than others, and some more stinky, but that doesn't mean we can't poo happy. Toilet sprinkles were created by sisters Donna and Debbie because of Debbie's relentless gut health issues and poo anxiety that hindered her normal socially sociable spirit. So inspired by their favorite childhood science project, Donna used the exploding volcano experiment to kick off their adventure using the effervescing lava concept to spread the natural essential oils over the toilet water. She mastered how to propel the fragrance quickly. Um, next cosmetic grade color, biodegradable glitter and fragrant natural essential oils were added. The rest is toilet sprinkle magic. Oh, so how does this work? Do you just sprinkle it in before you go to the bathroom? Yeah, <laughs> um, the, the directions are, are very um, explicit, not explicit, but they're more than I wanna share on the channel. Basically, you sprinkle it and then you go to the bathroom and it's supposed to help. Um, my problem with these type of products, cause I have like the poopery too, is I just forget to use it and then it's too late, you know? Um, not to be TMI. Oh, that smells good. That smells like Christmas tree candy, like a candied Christmas tree. I don't know if that makes sense, but that's really cool. Very different, was not expecting to get something like this in the box, but I do think that it is really, really cool 
and um, I'll give it a try. So that is everything in the Good Vibe Scribe box for December 2020, specifically the Grinch themed box. So if you get the plaid buffalo box, let me know down in the comments below what came in that box. I'll have to like see if I can find a video. I'm curious to see what came in that box too. But definitely let me know your thoughts down below. Which box are you gonna pick or did you pick if you're signing up um, and are gonna be a premium subscriber? If you're not a premium subscriber, you don't get to pick. Um, you just get whichever one. Um, so definitely let me know all your thoughts down in the comments below. Again, I do have that code where you can get a free gift with your first box and I will see you in my next video.